Hello, it's February 3rd. I'm at work and um, I've been here since 2 o'clock and um, it's been a long day, you know, not gonna lie, work can get intense, but um, at the same time I'm feeling proud of myself that that um, I'm capable of so much, you know. Because it's a very demanding job, so, like, I'm, like, looking at myself, like, like, wow, you know, like, I'm, I'm just, like, I'm doing more than I ever thought I can do in a job, you know what I mean? So it's challenging, so it's, it's good for me, it puts me in a position where I have to challenge myself, you know? At the same time, it um, it hits me so hard when I get home from work and I realize that I'm an adult and I have to be responsible for myself and I need to, like, take care, get my shit together. I have to, like, I have animals, so I need to be responsible for my animals, you know, I have to... I have to clean up my house after them, I have to take care of them, like, tomorrow I need to take all the three cats to the vet. And I'm like, I feel the stress, I feel the, how do you say, like, when you're, um, I feel the stress of being an adult, you know? <laughs> I feel like, because I have to be responsible for myself, so, like, I feel the stress of needing to get up in the morning and get my cats all together to the vet all on my own, you know? And like when I need to see the doctor and everything I need to do on my own, you know, it's not like I have anyone to do it for me, like, you know, I'm not a child anymore. <clears throat> Some people have, I think, they have an easy time, like, being, uh, being an adult, you know, and they enjoy it. But some people have a hard time, like me, for example, <laughs> you know, like, I enjoy my independence. But at the same time, I'm kind of like, I wish I had someone to lean on, you know? That's the truth. I feel like most people have someone to leave, lean on, whether it's a family member or, you know, a boyfriend or um, a friend or whatever. Like, they have someone to lean on, you know? I feel completely on my own, you know? Um, I'm not on my own completely, but I, that's how I feel. I feel like I'm an adult completely, like, everything is on my shoulders, you know? <laughs> I guess that's just adult life, you know? That's just, some people, they need to grow up before their time, you know? Some people, thank God I didn't have that, but some people, they have to grow up at the age of 10, you know? They have to be an adult, <laughs> you know? And I can't imagine needing to be an adult at that age, you know, because I'm freaking 31 and I'm struggling with it, you know. Um, anyhow, um, what else is on my mind? Um, yeah, so I get home at, um, I get home at 11 o'clock tonight and I know by the time I get in the bed, it's going to be like 2 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Yeah, tomorrow I have a big day. I need to come back to work for, um, cause they're doing like a, a course on like CPR or whatever. But before that I need to take my cats to the vet. So it's gonna be a long, long day. And then I need to go get litter for my cats. And then I need to, <clears throat> um, what was I thinking? Yeah, so I got my sewing machine today. I got my sewing machine and um, my I got it from the, the post office. They wanted to give me crap because they don't have appointments till Sunday, but the guy, one of the people working there told me to wait. Just go, go to the lady straight, to the lady, give her the paper and ask to get your package. Maybe she'll give it to you. So I did that and I got my sewing machine. Now I just need to figure out how to work it. <laughs> Maybe I can make a small business out of that you know and then like when I get home I 
I feel like suddenly the, the, the realization of my adulthood collapses on my shoulder and and then I feel like, oh my God, I need like some sort of connection, you know, like with whoever. So I have this dating app, so I know like, I don't think I'll find anyone on there, but it's kind of a distraction, you know, to distract me from my responsibilities, you know, but it is frustrating having to deal with like Tinder people, you know, like, you know, it's just, there's no real people on there, you know, there are some real people, but those kind of people, they're not usually physically what I'm attracted to, you know, <laughs> there's one guy that I, I keep thinking about, he was um, the older, the older guy, um, he, I don't keep thinking about it, but I felt like I had more of a connection to him, you know, so sometimes when I'm feeling alone, I'm like, oh, maybe I should just get back together with him, but then I'm like, remember the reasons why you're not with him, you know, obviously, you know, because, you know, I'm thinking about the future here, not just for now, you know what I mean? It's easy to live in the now, but at the same time, when I, I feel like I, I'm living in the now, right? That's like the same um, concept of like hookup culture. It's kind of like no one's thinking for the future. Everyone's thinking for the moment pleasure. You know what I mean? And I'm not into that, you know? Like, <clears throat> I understand that now is all we have, technically, philosophically speaking. You know, like now is, now is what we have, right? Because we don't know what's going to be in a moment in time, but... At the same time, practically, you know, now can stretch for to the future, you know what I mean? And you don't want to be in now all the time. You don't want to be stuck in now with the same person for a long moment in time, you know, because then it's frustrating and I guess it's a waste of time. You know what I mean? Philosophically speaking, I don't know. So today I got a new oven also, a tiny little oven, you know, so that I can cook stuff. Like I can make toast, I can cook some potatoes in it, maybe I could cook chicken, you know. So that's nice, I, I got that. And it was 170 shekel, 50 bucks. And then I, I got like a little speaker radio thingy, like an old-fashioned kind of radio thingy. So I... Um, the AM is, or the FM is not working. One of the stations, the uh, AM, I think it's the FM that's not working. But at least I have the speaker and it's cute, you know, so I can attach it through Bluetooth and get the music going, you know. So, um, yeah, so that's the story about that. I spent some money today. <laughs> but I've been working a lot, so I hope to make it up, you know. I hope to have enough money to make up for it. And, um, yeah, it's a story for now. Good luck to me tomorrow with my cats and everything. Good luck to me, you know? Really good luck to me. And, um, you know. <clears throat> Yeah, I'll leave that out. I have nothing more to say. Whatever I'm going to say is not something I'm going to sh share with the public. Okay, have a nice day. <laughs> Good night. Bye-bye.